to show you a very distinct and different method and combination of stretches to really open up your shoulder girdle to increase your range of motion both on your back swing and your follow through. Now this method involves the use of a band, medium thickness band, I'll have information down in the post below. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to do what we call a distraction stretch. So I'm going to have you reach into the band with your hand like this, curl it around and open your palm up. What we're doing is we're biasing external rotation. So from this position, I'll have you lean back and really allow the stretch of the shoulder, the anterior shoulder. And what I want you to do is I want you to think about this, allowing the band to actually pull your shoulder out. The temptation, sort of the, the intuitive uh, thing to do is kind of resist against it, but instead resist that, that temptation and allow the band to pull the shoulder, distract it, if you will, a little up and out of the shoulder joint like this. Then you can start moving around a little bit, finding where the, the areas are tighter, finding where you need it to be released. Now you can actually do this stretch for quite a long time. You can do this for 30 seconds, but you can also do it for a minute, minute and a half, even two minutes. It should not be painful. It should be a kind of a unique feeling of the shoulder being the arm being pulled up and out of the joint a little bit. The next version, which is a great chest opener, chest and shoulder opener, you're going to stand up, you're going to turn sideways, take a big step out, and again, think about that palm being turned up toward the ceiling, external rotation, and you're going to open up and you're again going to move in to the different areas that you'll find are tight and it could be either direction, just go ahead and search them out and let them stretch out again. Allow the arm to distract a bit out of the shoulder. You're going to feel that in the bicep, shoulder, probably a lot in the chest. Again, allowing a much wider uh, back to me and follow through. Now I'm going to do this third, final version facing with my right hand so that it's easier to see. I'm again going to reach in, loop around, turn the palm up. Now what you'll probably notice my, my golfers absolutely love this version, is it looks an awful lot like the straight arm of golf swing. Of course, I'm in a left-handed golfer position where I lift my right arm straight here, but you can actually get that chin over the shoulder, and again, allow that arm to be distracted. You'll feel a, a kind of a rotational distraction stretch throughout your lats, uh, posterior shoulder and arm, and again, move the shoulder one way or another way to search out where the tight uh, areas are on you personally, and I think you're going to really immediately sense just how productive this stretch, this lengthening of, uh, of, of the arm and shoulder is going to be for you in your golf swing. So, try out these new stretches. As always, if you have any questions, please uh, comment down below and I'll always answer them for you. Let's get out there, increase our backswing, get after old man Park.